Well, the 12 days always fly by. Gates closed on the 2023 Minnesota State Fair a little over an hour ago. Jennifer Hoff is at the fair tonight with how this year stacked up. Jennifer? Pretty different to be out here, Julie, when things are quiet and everyone has went home. So far, only one day broke an attendance record. Perhaps that was because of the record-breaking heat. But still, it couldn't put a damper on all the fun. This year, the great Minnesota get-together was instead the year we would sweat together. <laughs> but for Nikki Tram... There's so much to do. The warmer weather didn't deter her from coming every day, a challenge she conquers every year. You just don't quite, quite eat as much. You drink a lot more liquids and more ice cream <laughs> just because it's cold. Temps topped out today at 98 degrees, breaking a Labor Day record set back in 1913, hovering around 100 several times with with oppressive humidity to kick off the fair that on the second day very busy set an attendance record more than 11,000 people than last year I think it's people are coming back to the fair Shirley Basinger was a park and ride attendant the whole time they were lined around all the way to the end of the parking lot working the fair for the last six years but enjoying it since moving to Minnesota in the 70s I love the animals I like the birth center um, and I love the food. Food and rides are always top of mind. But so too was security. That was a roller coaster after the police department disbanded in the past and staffing was short. The chief saying this year he hired 40 more officers, installed metal detectors and more security cameras that made everything all the more memorable for everyone. It felt, yeah, really fun this year. There was a good vibe, good happy vibe. We did have a lot of questions to get a, a solid sense of exactly how things went this year, but neither the police chief or the fair spokesperson said that they would uh, take our interview request, saying they were busy with all of the wrap-up activities that now take place for everybody here out on the grounds. Still busy for them. Again, grounds closed about an hour ago as they continue to pack up and get out of here as people do this all again next year. Julie, um, back to you. Thanks so much, Jennifer. That's a wrap for 2023.